Eva, it is 2021, and what do you do at the end of a long trip when you arrive at your destination? You tweet. <laughs> and that is what Perseverance has done, tweeting out, hello world, oh. my first look at my forever home. Dr. Katie Coleman, <laughs> what will the rover they call Percy be doing in her new digs? In her, in the, in in, in, her Mars. First, in, in Mars. <laughs> What's she so, going to get up to? How's she going to spruce up well, the Well, she's got a lot of exciting instruments on board to be able to really understand where she is, which is basically in the middle of a, a, a big lake where a river dumped in there and then all this sediment went in there. And so we're going to be able to look at in that sediment, you know, was there any microbial life? trapped in there. So we've got all these instruments and they're really fun. It's almost like laser tag on Mars where you can, one of them, you can actually use a laser the size of a human hair and shoot at a rock, explode the rock, look at the image and understand what elements are present. So that's just one of the ways. We've got cameras on board. The mast cam, which stands up really tall, has for the very first time on Mars, zoomable cameras. We've always just had like a wide angle and then a zoom. And now be, that we have ones that can zoom together, we can actually make stereo vision on Mars. It's good for the rover for when it's using its robotic arm, wants to know. And it's also great for us to understand the terrain and actually get to go on a trip there, I think, and really feel like we're there. I want to know more about these cameras. Let's um, go to Gio Benitez, who's at JPL. W what do we know about the cameras that are on this rover? Well, you know what, Eva? First off, I want to go ahead and tell you that I'm over at the Wally -E Cam. I'm calling it the Wally -E Cam because it, it kind of looks a little like Wally, -E, right? Um, so I just want to show you because there's a very specific reason why uh, this image was so low res, the one that we've been seeing there. Because if you take a look right here, we're going to have this camera zoom in here. So you can see this is where that image is. It's coming from these cameras. There's another camera in the back. And these are called the Haz Cams. These are the hazard cameras, the very specific purpose is to make sure that this landed safely and that they could see what that whatever it is that they could see right there at that particular spot very very quickly and that's why it's a low res image so it's very very important to get that so quickly but now over the next few hours and days we will start getting more images in color uh, from the other cameras again 23 cameras on board the rover right now so we're gonna see better pictures <laughs> Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.